Greetings and welcome. I'm Psychic Medium Roberto and I truly hope you're doing well today. I am guided by spirit and thank you for watching today. So not so much a crime case today. I'm going to be having a look at the arrival of the Russian vessels in Cuba and just get a sense of what the numbers are saying. And of course, it is quite a thing to see all these vessels arrive. And of course, there is a nuclear powered submarine with no nuclear weapons on board. So we led to believe. Um, but quite an event. So let's have a look at this main chart here. I've got America's uh, details. At the bottom here, I've got Cuba, Russia, even the Russian Secret Service and Vladimir Putin, right? Now, the arrival sounded on June the 12th. Um, but as mentioned, I believe there may have been... They were obviously in the area the day before and approaching because June 11, we have a double eight standoff here. So the... So eight, the number is war, but in this case, because we see the three eights is a communication threat that is sent out by 16-7, and who is 16-7, Mr. VP here. Okay, because we can all agree, technically Vladimir Putin is Russia. So the day before we have all these eights, the 16-7. And on the day of the arrival, Wednesday, 17-8, pings on Vladimir Putin who has triple 17 eights. So we can clearly see, of course, in the physical, the arrival of the Russians. But in numerology, it's pinging all on Vladimir Putin. Now, I've done some work because I wanted to just see if there's, I want, initially, I just want to see if there's any anomalies because arriving on Wednesday and apparently they're going to stay for five days, right? So they would leave around about June 17, June 18. Don't quote me on when they're leaving, but apparently two reports, five days. So I've gone till June 18. Um, so when I was having a look to see any anomalies, I picked up an anomaly. The 22-4 on June 16. This 22-4 is a hidden 22-4, which means, tells me, now we're looking from the perspective of Russians in Cuba, right? And the threats against America. So technically, according to the White House, there's no threat, right? But what I'm seeing in the numbers here is there's a hidden 22-4 agenda, hidden agenda, hidden plan. And we note the day starts with a 16-7, which is Putin. So Putin has a hidden plan. Thirty-three is a concern number in the light of nuclear, and the twenty-one-three. I want to just check something there quickly. The twenty-one-three pings directly on the U.S. So 
So what I'm saying is, Putin has a hidden plan about America while he is here. And we can all agree, because tensions are running thick there with Russia and China and Ukraine and so on, that Putin has the balls to park his ships apparently 15 kilometers or 15 miles from the US um, the 12-3 is also including Russia as well as Cuba Twenty-one three, we got that. The thirteen three. I'm not saying there's a threat. All I'm saying is there's a hidden plan why they are here. Now we might say that's obvious because it's obvious, right? But numerology is telling us that there is. And what is the threat? 13-4. War. Death. Seventeen eight. the next day. Also Putin. This is Putin's little toy game that he's playing here. Or I should say, this is Putin's war games going on here. 17-8. And before I realized, I was wondering, who is the 14-5? And then I recalled the U.S.'s birthday, 14-5, 14-5. So in the middle of this plan, who is the plan about? The U.S. And I'm sure, and I'm sure, on both sides and other agencies are monitoring this very carefully. But there's definitely a hidden agenda. And that's why I've oranged June 16 and June 17 and June 18. The 31.4 is not a good number. Now, I'm not predicting anything. I'm not saying anything is going to happen. I'm just showing you the plan involves the US. So 31.4, this 31.4 is not a very nice number. Pings on the Federal Security Services. So this is what I'm saying. There's a sideshow happening here, and it's not really a sideshow, it's quite a big operation. With all these vessels coming in. But like I said, there's agencies on the ground. 12-3 and 21-3 is also CIA. 31-4, we've got federal security services running around here. This is a tense moment, and when I started seeing the videos yesterday, I mean, I didn't panic, I didn't panic, um, but it did pique my ears and eyes. And here's this 22-4 plan here. Um, 13-4. June 18, so this is all Putin here, right? Putin and security services, but in the middle is the 14.5. So let's have a look here. 22.4 on June 16, hidden plan. The 23.5 is the plan has been shared. The plan has been shared within the community. In other words, the bedfellows of Cuba and Russia is being shared about 
14.5. Wouldn't it be interesting to be a fly on the wall in those meetings? And the outcome 13.4. Problem. So June 18. Uh, where did I see this before? June 18 pings directly on the US, outcome US, so 18.9. So if we continue 23.5 at the 24.6, is it made to appear as friendly? Hidden plan 22.4 within their community, made to look like these operations are just hunky-dory friendly operations as usual which it is in a way it is apparently um, but the outcome pings directly on the us here as well now i'm not saying anything's going to happen please don't get me wrong i believe this is more of a reconnaissance mission than anything else a effect finding machine a uh, mission plans comrades discussions we all on the same page type encounters so these for me are the alarming days because this for me reveals to me what is actually going on So they will have their drills and Russia apparently already fired missiles. Um, there's big movement going on, obviously. I think, not I think, June 18 is more of a USA day. I'm actually going to take the orange border off that one. It's more US numbers. Um, so let's look of the day of the arrival 12 3 18, 9. so how's this number i'll be a pardon 26 8 i'm just moving this here 26 8 so we speak in the crime shows about show of force this is like a staging of force. Eight. How much machines do you have? How many machines do you have? 26, eight. So definitely flexing of the muscles. And with all these eights, what is the message that Putin is putting through? As you know, this does, um, I do resonate with the situation because um, approximately, I would say, now, um, at least three or four years ago, maybe four or five, right about there, I started seeing Russia-China wars. Um, so these are the only three day, or let's say June 16, June 17 are the only two days that I see information what is going on here. And technically it would fall in the reflective zone of uh, the arrival, but that's what it, there's definitely plans going on operationally, maybe not for now, it's setting the groundwork Let's say that. So if we have ears hearing, that would be very good. But June 14, there's big activity here. Huh? This might even allude to the, the drills that they're having, but these are big numbers here. Can be in a war context, explosions, 28. Um, 
explosions 10 1 um, Twenty one three. This was the US here, June fifteen. Uh, of course, there's a lot going on in the backgrounds, but for me, June sixteen, June seventeen reveal. Master plan. It's been worked on in the background. They're presenting the show of force as we see it. with their fellow Cubans for later on. So worth keeping an eye on the situation. Um, but I personally find it quite threatening. I'm, I'm not even near there. Um, I would just want as much information as possible. So we'll watch the daily briefings. All right, ladies and gentlemen, let me know what your thoughts are. Short reading. Uh, I just want to see if there were any anomalies, and I do believe I found some information. All right, let me know what your thoughts are. I do engage with your thoughts, and please stay safe, stay alert, and I'll see you in the next one. Bye for now.